Hi everyone. Today we will continue structure question modeling in AMOS and um, impute data and model comparison. In this video, we will learn impute data and model comparison, how two models we have created when we will compare both these models. So let's take, I am just showing how we have to impute data. This is my previous video file and I would like to impute this data right in the same file so i have to click on analyze you could see here is the data imputation you will click on this right and you will click on this and after that in this model i think there is the just a moment i will open up my file and uh, what i will do i will I will I will press OK. Then I will run this file, right? And all these things, everything, all the values are here, right? And uh, standardized, unstandardized. Now I would like to impute this data, right? I would like to impute this data. I will press analyze. Press analyze. I will I will click on analyze. Then data imputation, and data imputation. You could see here. This is the file name. First, you have to give file name where you want to save. So you have to give this file name and uh, you have to press save, then impute. If you will press impute, then this file that would be saved in your the same folder. Then if you would like to, because I have not pressed it because already I have imputed file in my that folder. So if you would like to see this file to so view data, you can you can you, you can press here view data and you can see here. I mean, no, I will first click on select the file. Just a moment. I will click on here is file name, right? And this is my imputed file, right? And I will open up this file and I would like to see view data, right? So we can see here this file. This file is my imputed file. Now you can see here earlier only these statements uh, where I have recorded my statements. These were here and now three more. We can see here in the variable view three more. This one is the imputed data is already here. This one is the government policy and all. So now what is the relevance of this imputed data? I will show you in this new file <clears throat> you could see here now i would like to check models right i would like to check models so what i have to do i will open a file new file name that is imputed file open up okay then i will click here and those are the this is the imputed data simply i will drag here right one is environment i had drag right here then there is the pbe right then this one is the government policy then <clears throat> then i will press this one is the perceived in perceived perception about the electric vehicle and last one is the behavioral intention <clears throat> i have already taken out now i can uh, move them right i can I, I can i can move them right i can arrange as per my requirement this one is the right and uh, i can resize them also right i can resize them this one is right now what i have to do i will connect them i will connecting them arrow these are all are all arrows i had connected now covariance also connecting here is the this one is and uh, this one then i have to connect that one then i can touch up right so these arrow would be now proper it would be looks presentable so now uh, i have to run this file i had already selected this file right output okay fine right click on now we have to run this file okay fine what is okay fine 
yes i uh, cancel this this thing because this require error term also so i had and plugins i have to give is unname unobserved variables i had pressed here so now i have to run this file right one more okay okay fine right there is also yeah then i can plugin then again name another value you can see here e1 and e2 is here now i have to run this file now file has run chi square and degree of freedom is here now i have to press here right so this is my output here is you can see chi square degree of freedom and probability level and uh, now I can see estimates also. All are significant. Environment 2%, right? All are significant. Values are here, right? Uh, perception about electric vehicle and PEBE, -E, right? Perceived economic benefit or everything that is significant. Now I have to press model fit. Model fit, you can see here degree of freedom 3. And this is a, right. This is my GFI. This is my AGFI and this is my CA, right? And all these things are here. Now I would like to compare and CFI also. I would like to compare this model with another model. So what I have to do here is, let's see here. And these are the my stand, these are the values, right? Unstandardized, standardized, each and everything is here. Now I would like to compare this model with another model. I mean, there is the, I have, I'm not satisfied with this model. Let's say I would like to analyze one more model. So what I have to do, I have to create one more model. I have to analyze this thing. So I will simply click on this. This is model one, right? Okay, fine. Then I have to create a new model, right? So this one is the model number two. So this name is model number two so i want in this model model one let's say here is i want to give this parameter name is the covariance as cov then i have press here now in the model two i want to say cov equal to zero because there is i believe in this thing let's say i'm presuming this thing there is no correlation between government policy and the environment so i would like to check this hypothesis whether it is true or it is false it is accepted or it is rejected so now i have to again the same thing i will run right and now chi square value is now we can see output now the new chi square value is we will model fit here is you can see here there is the two things semen 46.804 that was when we were working on the model one model one was what when model one was this was when there was the in the model one there was the value we were not reading as zero right that time it was the value was 0.36 in the model one but in the model two i had already given covariance equal to zero so now you can see here covariance equal to zero that means there is no connection in between government policy and the environment so now output we are comparing in the output file model fit you can see here in model two now semen is 153 and this one is the semen divided by degree of freedom this degree of freedom is also increased and you can see here is gfi is point this is point nine model 1.955 but in model two gfi is 0.873 right we can copy this thing in our um, word document also so easily we can compare these models right we can increase our right so now you can see here yes this is my model one model one gfi is 0.955 right and in model two, where I had uh, made a change, 
in between government policy and the environment, I said this one is the no correlation, no, no covariance, right? So here is, you can see here is, there is no correlation 0.873. So GFI values decreased, right? So now in the output, you can see here, GFI value is decreased and this one is the degree of freedom is also changed and semen is also increased, 153. So now model comparison. We will click here. Again, I will copy this thing in my Word document and uh, I will paste here, control V. So now you could see here model, model one and model. And this one is the, I. this one is the, this, this, this statement is very, very important. In this statement, they said assuming model one is to be correct. Model one is to be correct. So model two, what is happening? I mean, here is there's a NFI is also that is you can see here in the output file in the model fit. Here is a NFI and all these things that is also reduced. How much it was reduced? That value is already given here. This one is 0.074 right same as ifi this one is the impact and rfi that was the impact tli is also there is the impact and that is not significant so we can say uh, in this in this thing i mean when we will reject this however i mean there is the correlation between government policy and the environment so we will reject this model right we will reject this model and i am just deleting this part so now again, I have to run this, this model one and same file I'm running, right? And uh, uh, here is, we will press this thing and unstandardize. You can see here, yes, we have, there is the relation between environment and body that is significant, right? So in that way, we have to uh, compare these models in a same same file right so i'm sure that would be helpful please try this thing and definitely i'm going to meeting with you with new video with mediation and moderation thank you everyone for watching this